Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix Microsoft Visual C++ runtime error or if you're receiving VC runtime 140.dll or msvcp140.dll which chain together game on your Windows computer. Now the first step is to make a right click on the game on Steam and then go to manage and then click on browse local files. It will take you to the game installation folder. Now over here, open the engine folder. Now open extras folder and then open reddish folder and then open enus folder and over here you will see this exe file. Make a right click on the exe file and then click on run as administrator and then click on yes to allow and then click on install. If you see the install option, click on install. In my case, it is already installed. Now if it is already installed, then you can click on uninstall once, close it and then you can make a right click once again and then click on run as administrator click on yes and then put a check over here agree and then click on install and once the installation is complete now you can launch the game and then check now still not la launching so in that case you can restart your computer once and after the system restart you can launch the game and then check now still not resolved in that case you can install visual C++ files on your computer. So copy this link. The link is provided in the video description. Open this link in a browser. It will take you to Microsoft website. Now on this website, here you can see visual studio 2015, 17, 19 and 22. Download x86 and then run the CXE file. Click on repair. If you see repair, if you see install, click on install. Click on yes to allow. Now download this x64 file. Now run this x64 file. Now again, if you see repair, click on repair. If you see install, click on install and let the installation complete. Make sure both the installation are complete. So this may take a few seconds or maybe a couple of minutes. Please ignore this error message setup failed because in my case, I have already installed it multiple times. So once this is installed, you will see a restart option like this. So click on restart. Make sure that you restart your computer after this. And after the system restart, you can launch the game and then check. Still not working, still you are receiving the error, then you can go to game in Steam and then go to properties and then go to install files tab and then click on verify integrity of game files. Now once the verification is 100% complete, then you can launch the game and then check. Now even after verifying the game files still not working, in that case you can uninstall and reinstall the game. You can click on uninstall and then you can reinstall the game to different drive and then check. So one of the steps shown in this video should help you to fix this, fix the error. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.